and welcome to the very no I said don't put it on to the very last sub as is just messing about with the washing machine. As I was saying, welcome back to my very last Ramadan vlog. Uh what month it's been. Now I don't think I've kind of shared this with you guys, but I this year I've struggled and I didn't think I would. Because last year I was breastfeeding and fasting longer days, but I coped really well. Yeah. So I thought the same would happen this year, but wasn't the case. I struggled with fatigue so badly. Like on days that I wasn't vlogging, I was completely crashed out and really struggling. And also trying to like keep up my energy levels up for the kids. It was all like so so tough when i thought about it i was like why why is it that this year i struggled is it because s is a year older she's a lot more active um and i was like yeah it could be that and it could also be that i didn't take any fluoridix um supplement you know the iron liquid i took that religiously last year and that kept my energy levels up um but this year i i didn't have any of it and i struggled so much um and I feel really bad saying this, but as a mom of two young children, I just, I'm just glad to be near to the days where I can just top up and boost myself up in terms of energy, like have a cup of coffee, eat food, because fasting when you're a mom is so draining. My conclusion on Ramadan 2023, I don't even know how, mid, how much and it breaks my heart but i hope next year i'll be a lot more prepared and i'll show i'll be sure to top up on that floridic supplement because that thing is something else right so right now i'm just cleaning the dishes and then oh, i need to show you my living room okay so we need a new sofa for the living room but we've got a bit of a dilemma because you know we have like warm beige walled with a sky blue ceiling right and we've had that for nine years and the only color sofas that would complement those colors is like neutral browns nudes you know um but i'm like okay i don't really want a brown fabric one. Oh, by the way it's going to be washable washable covers so that means it's going to end up being fabric it's going to be fabric and not leather right so i was like i'm not sure how i how fabric kind of match it all i don't know so it's either fabric or beige but like imagine beige. even if i can cook even if i can like wash um the covers like two young kids a beige i'd constantly be like oh my gosh don't eat there and be careful and blah 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 and i don't want that like okay the next dilemma is okay don't get any nudes or like don't get a neutral color to get something like gray now gray is not gonna match my walls which means we need painting we need to paint them yes it's like no i don't want to touch the walls i really love the blue sky in all honesty i've had enough of the blue sky at first i was like wow this is so cool this is so different after nine years of seeing that blue ceiling i am done Halas, that's it i want a blue ceiling that's it it's a plum mm. oh, big bye <laughs> Oh, I love that. You hold it. That's you hold it. Good girl. Right. But in my eyes, I'm like, okay, if we get grey, the walls should be like, not white, but like off-white. The ceiling needs to be all white. It just needs to be clean. And I think with all that, with the features that we have on that ceiling, which are beautiful, I think it just looks really nice. Um, And yeah, I really don't want a grey house, but it looks like it's going to, so we're heading that. Oh, I might paint the walls like this color, like a grayish, grayish beige. I don't know. So the reason I'm telling you this is because we're going to go to Ikea to check out some sofas in person and see what they've got. Um, again, we're not sure if this is going to be a sofa that we're going to take to our new house. We're still looking for a house. Or if it's a sofa that we're going to just leave. Uh, the issue is, if we're going to leave it, we don't want to spend too much. But then... So I'm a picky and I want something that's going to match the aesthetics at least. Uh, so I have a feeling we're going to end up spending more than we want. So it's going to come to, it's going to have to come to our new home. <sighs> right. <laughs>
Right, so I'm waiting for Yasa to finish work and then we're going to head to Ikea. And yeah, check out what's so first. Oh, you know what else I need to do? I realize this is the longest intro ever. Guys, please give me some feedback down below. Yesterday I did the quickest intro and I just got into things. And today I am rambling as I always do. But please just let me know. Do you mind it? Or would you rather me just get into the action straight away? Let me know, let me know down in the comments. Anyway, if you're new here, my name is Madeline. I'm a mum of two. I create lifestyle kind of content. It used to be heavy on motherhood, but then I felt, what's it called? Uh, imposter syndrome. And I was like, like, okay, you're a mom, but you're not an expert, right? And then I had all these horrible thoughts and then I ended up just, like I stopped doing all these mother things which is such a shame because I do love to like research and learn about all these things. And I thought it'd be good to pass it on, but then yeah, imposter syndrome kicked in and was like, nope, calm down. Okay, you ain't no expert. Oh, it's quite a sad thing that is. Uh, so now I just focus on lifestyle. I will share the things that I've learned through my kids with you guys uh, and like offer things, offer suggestions. Um, but yeah, that's my kind of channel. If you like that kind of stuff, please consider sticking around, hit that subscribe button, and let's be friends. I wonder what's going Sorry, why is it? There we go. I'm not why. <laughs> No, 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 no. Right, you put way too much. No, trust me, it's fine. <laughs> We're just cleaning our makeup brushes. Oh, yes, I'm going to have surgery. What? I'm going to have surgery. Dad! 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 Yeah, this is what it smells like. Dad! Uh, what are we taking today? Let around to my mum's. Samosa, hummus, falafel, yeah. and, and chocolate samosa, lotus samosa. Yeah, We're making falafels. I bought back four boxes, chill out. I mean, how are you making it? Tesco. Yeah. Che. I don't have a food processor, yes, sir. Need a food processor, sir. Food processor, sir. Food processor, Food processor. And then we're going to go to that shop now. You're drinking it. Guys, it's dry. Yeah, it's it's enough for me. Okay. That's more like it. Is yeah. it dry? Yeah. It's a little bit damp. Don't lie. <laughs> She's not fasting. <laughs> but I think it. No, but to say we dumped it up on that. Yeah. Like we soaked it. So I guess you have to. So that's good. So I thought that would be really good. I was telling you guys, it's too fun to buy on the show. We don't have to use it. I do know how to use well, it. Well, they drop it. 
I, I wasn't paying attention to the mouth. This is what happens when you have kids. Person decided they needed a haircut. And this is my foundation brush. <laughs> so annoying. And then you tried to deny it wasn't me. Well, so was it, Sabrine? Why did you do it as well? <laughs> Why? I didn't think she'd plot and she came. So did you do it? I was like, no. No lie, it would have probably been worse than this. No, I would flat. <laughs> you know, there's all things like that. I'm like, I'm sure it's flat so she doesn't plot. <laughs> background so probably copyrighted so oh, yeah, it's it's like, and, then she, and then she followed it by a kiss straight away she was so whatever she said and then gave me a kiss so like, I was I love you I need to go find your shoes what's up so we're we'll going somewhere went to Asda we're going to work cafes as well no we're not here we are why because I need to pick up one more buyer right so basically I've got to go to Iceland and quickly go pick, uh, pass them up. Goodbye. I'm really excited, Murphy. I'm excited as well because you know what's yours is mine. Oh, oh, it says my name on there. Oh, well, it's not yours. Oh, you bought an Abaya again. But, let me explain. This Abaya is from Dubai, isn't it? Oh, whatever that is, it smells beautiful. Yeah, I know, I just bought it. <laughs> I've got this already. Blue, baby blue and I'm, on, I'm in love with it and I got it from oh, Dubai we need to take that to Turkey I know my friend bought me from, um, from Dubai I've got a beige uh, let me tour yeah, we can match sorry go on it's okay I know <laughs> basically my friend bought me it from Dubai and then every time she's gone I've got her to get me a different colour so I've got like khaki green baby blue black have we got brown I've got a chocolate brown so yeah and then I've made a little collection but you can only get it from Dubai so obviously Kefa stocks up nicely I've got it in cream! Oh, and I got two babes. I couldn't pick. When I was in the shop last time, Kefa told me to spray one on this arm and one on this arm. And then give it an hour and I'll know which one I want. And basically within an hour I knew I wanted both. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's this one. Just wear and mix it up. I oh, know this is the one I'm currently wearing, Amarati. Oh my god, it's beautiful, isn't it? It's it very is very nice. And then this one is it's very similar. It's called it's called this. That way. And then my mom's eye bayer is in here as well. Guys, yeah. Well, Smiling's gone. I'm just gonna talk so much shit. Right. Me and Madeline are going to Turkey in July. Inshallah. And I've got my own room. And I can tell you now, Qasim's gonna be there 24/7. I just know it, 100%, and I can't wait. All my days, guys, last time we went, yeah, me and Medley went to the spa, and it was the first ever time I went to a spa, and I basically fell asleep, and I cannot wait for this spa. I'm going to get a facial, a head massage. Oh, my God. Yeah, I'm going to pull a Yasser. You know Yasser when he went to look for towels for three hours? I'm going to do that. I'm going to go look for towels for three hours. And I'm gonna come back glowing. My eyelashes are really short, by the way, but Medlin's Primark mascara. Do you know what, guys? Sometimes cheaper is better. How about that? Because Medlin asked me if I want anything from Asda, and I said to her, "Buy me a coffee, please. The cheapest one you can find." Medlin, um, just wanted to say I love you a lot. Can't lie, I've probably done about ten videos, so I don't know if you're gonna see this. But if you do, I love you, and I appreciate everything you do for me. It doesn't go unnoticed. Genuinely, well, thank you so much because you gave me a life, a long barrack, beautiful life. And you do lots of new experiences with me. But yeah, guys, Walla Medley is just a 1010 sister. But she pisses me off. But I love her. Do you know what I mean? That's my blood. That's my bedroom. 
I'm joking, but Wallah Madeline, Allah Mubarak. She's such a nice person. Yeah. And her kids. Oh, her kids, man. I love them. I'm waffling so much. I'm so bored. Why is it taking her so long? She's gone. She's gone. Listen to this. Yeah. She's gone to buy shoes. Um, I think trousers and a coffee. Three things. Yeah. We'll see how much shit she comes back with. Guess who was right? I'm gonna do a haul for you. She got two Caesar salad cakes. I was thinking that's for tomorrow's lunch. Tomorrow's dinner, sorry. Tomorrow's for Lord, for goodness sake. Yep. She got Persim. I probably think maybe Asia. Kim does. Yeah, I want a beach. Yep. Got my coffee. Thank you. <gasps> they've got they've got the coffee. Yeah. I just wanted to so, the, so the Asda one, I just bought it to try it out, but I knew you were talking about that one. Guys, listen, I was telling Mandy yeah, recently branded things have just not been as nice. Like, I used to be so for branded, but I kind of like the supermarket versions now more. This coffee is amazing. I used to buy the Starbucks one all the time. For this one, it's so much better. I just try it. Anyways, she also got chocolate chip cookies. This is why I don't go in a supermarket when you want it. She's not going to eat these. She's going to eat her food and she's going to be fine. Yeah, yeah, I'll eat them for the Sahur. She bought herself a coffee. Six Victoria sponge cakes. Oh, that nice. So good. You're not even faster, so you can have one now. Oh my days, they look beautiful. And they've not put it on top, which makes it better, so you can just. Hang on, which way? No, you're using the right lane. Oh, yeah, you are, you're going right, Mads. To be honest, they're both right lanes. No, you you do need to be in this lane. Because at the end, you're going to take a right into Pitsmore. Okay. Anyways, it's fine. So, yeah. Cupcakes. We can edit all this out, innit? Yeah. Okay, just give me a minute because I'm flipping hot. Okay, guys, back to it. She bought. Oh my god, that is so cute. Wait. Uh, I thought I'd buy a class of some Eid Ramadan um, pajamas. Guys, you know what's so cute? He's already got some Paw Patrol pajamas, and like ages ago, he came downstairs and by me, it does not fit him no more. He was like, Mama, it still fits me. It's like up to here. So give me some yeah, happy. And, okay, and this is why it took me so long to get out of Asda. I was trying to find some cute pajamas for Asi as well. I couldn't find any, and I felt so bad walking out without without any pajamas for her as well. Don't worry, we'll find her some. They are so cute though. Okay. She loves these, she smashes them back like it's no one's business. But yeah guys, this is the haul. Hope you enjoyed, maybe it's not as good as um, their names, but... What are we doing? Ah! We're in Ikea, I've just dropped Basim off at the whole like play arena, wherever you want to call it. I'm going to head straight to the sofa section. Are you all right? That's not how you test the sofa. How do you test the sofa? Come here, hold the phone. Let me show you how it's done, babes. You ready? Have you not seen that TikTok guy? No. I said, come on, let's go. Oh, she's picking up. <laughs> come on. So dramatic. I would say just to give it like extra protection, that's all from maybe tearing or and if it if it means that I can cut Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. Twenty-four. So it's nearly 5 p.m. and we're shattered. We went in to check the sofas and we saw maybe one or two. But for the price, for the price, I, I was 
we're we'll, we'll like, okay, we're going to look elsewhere and see. Bless her. Take her. No, we're she's gonna go home now. She needs to rest. I can sleep at night. Okay, so it's around 6 pm and I'm just heating up the London. So I've got four of these, four boxes to uh, heat up and then that'll be ready to take to my in-laws. Yeah. I can't hear what you're saying. The air fan is too the air fry is too loud. I'm going to tackle this one. I don't know if it needs more. Ooh, it does think It stinks like nail polish remover. I'm so bad at remembering to, to clean my uh, makeup brushes. And I think this is a game changer. And it will really help with like my acne. Because, yeah. And also, I've stopped wearing foundation. Because I'm just, I can't be bothered. I cannot be bothered. But I've noticed like my skin has cleared up loads. I don't know it's because I've reduced the amount of foundation that I wear. So I'm not, you know, going in with a brush that's not being cleaned. So less bacteria on my face. I don't know. Or is it because I've got a good skincare routine that I actually stick to? Oh, these falafel smell amazing. Oh my gosh. Let's talk about what I'm craving right now. So it's day 24 of Ramadan and right now all I want is a cup of coffee. I want some, oh, let me show you. I want four triple chocolate cookies and I want these mini Victoria sponge cakes. So a cup of coffee, these two. I also want some pineapple. Pineapple. And that's it. I'll be happy. That's all I want. That's all I'm craving. I am, I am quite dehydrated, so a cup of water. And there is my clean brush. It's just slightly damp. What should I clean next? This is such an old brush, and I need to replace it. Um, but it's what I use to put like my bronzer on, but it needs replacing. Right, I've put quite a lot. Can you see it? Can you see it move? And then watch how it just absorbs it all. moving anymore so it is around 7 p.m. and we are on our way to my in-laws I've got so much sambusa to make I just hope I have time Kasim's, he has just nipped to get some um, milk from the shop however he's just stood there catching up with some friends like we've got nowhere to be um, so hopefully he'll hurry but yeah, I've got my falafel here and it smells so good. Ooh. I don't think there'll be enough to be I honest, that, but we'll I see. Falafel. Falafel. So we're finally home from my in-laws and it's around 10 p.m. so it's really late. Kasim's just gone to bed. Yas is taking Asia for a bit of a, a, a ride to help her fall asleep. She's full of energy even at this time. She should be fast asleep by now, but she's not. But yeah, we had a feast. There was so much food um, and I am so stuffed. Like, I don't think I'm going to be able to like have a cookie or even have like a Victoria sponge, which makes me really sad. I might come down later for suhoor and treat myself to one. Um, oh yeah, I cleaned all my brushes by the way. Oh, they look so good. And they're just dry. They're all dry, love it. Anyways, uh, I'm like, I'm getting distracted. So guys, this is the end of Ramadan 2023 vlogs. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed the content that I've been able to create. Honestly, some days I was like, I don't know what to talk about. I don't know what to share, but I've still gone ahead and done what I could. I hope you guys have enjoyed my company. Thank you to everyone that has subscribed, to everyone that continues to support me, you know, with every single video and show me love and leave me a lovely comment. Uh, you guys make my day and you help me keep, keep doing what I do. 
um i hope you all have a lovely eid i'm hoping it's on saturday because yes i only has half a day at work on saturday so he'll be able to be present and enjoy it with us but yeah i hope you guys have a lovely eid stay safe and i will see you soon